Hey guys, it's Carrie. Welcome back to the channel. And today I'm actually really excited to start, which is probably going to be like a semi series. I'm not really sure how I'm going to do this, but I, okay, I've been, have had these in my Amazon inbox for so, so long. And I stopped by randomly at, um, I think it was TJ Maxx. And TJ Maxx had the mother load. These are the Peapod Baby Bees. They are for ages three plus. They come with um, 22 accessories, I guess, inside. And then there's an extra surprise, babies in pods. So I don't know if they're gonna, it's gonna be another baby or what, but look at that artwork. It's so cute. And they're basically babies in pea pods. Uh, so tiny, so cute. Three peas with seven surprises. You can get a baby, uh, clothing and accessories in those pods. Um, it, they also, I guess, apparently squirt water so they spit up. Uh, this is the list of all the ones that you can collect. I don't know if they're random. Uh, if you can get doubles besides the one that's showing, I don't know. But there are um, rares over here. So there's six rares you can get. And then there's two super rare twins. So I don't know. Uh, the girl that we have um, showing today is Carmilla. Or Carmilla. And these are by... I guess they're indie toys because when you look at the branding, it says imported and distributed by... Thin Air brand, so I guess that's what they are. Thin Air brand. You're gonna find them on all the social media. Um, yeah, and this is called the Dinner and Bath Time Playset. Um, they're babies and peas. I think it's great. So let's just go ahead and get it opened. I guess now finally. I love the little logo. Uh. I don't know if I have never seen these in person before. Like I said, I had I've had them in my inbox for a while on Amazon, and I keep wanting to buy them, but they've been they were a little expensive. I think this set was like thirty bucks on Amazon, and I got it um, for twelve ninety nine. So I thought that was a pretty good deal considering I've been desiring them for a while. I don't know how to open this box. I'm trying. Oh, this is written on the inside. It says we have a high chair. Uh, we have accessory and birth certificate. And then we have clothing and then bathtub. Okay, let's take a look here. Everything's on the green tone, which makes sense since they're considered um, pea pods. Pea pod babies. This is so cool. All right, so we have this. I don't know. If, I think this. I think we build this high chair here. I think this is like the part that goes under, and this is the part that they sit on. It's a little seat thing here. Let's pull this out. I have a feeling this goes here, like that maybe. Oh, this is the bathtub. Obviously a pea green. We have a little. We have a couple of cup holders here. Nothing else to write home about. Just a serial number on the bottom. And then I think this also might be part of the high chair. Ah, this probably goes on here. And then I guess this can slide over it to have somewhere to eat your food. Oh, so I hold in the tape. So we have a yellow, super squishy bowl. It's like a squishy rubber. And then we have a water bottle here. I'm guessing you can put like a water in this. This is pink. And it has a tan top, but it doesn't look like it comes off. I don't think it's supposed to. I think you're supposed to just no, it doesn't even squeeze. It's really hard. I don't I don't get it. But apparently this is not what you use to uh squeeze water in. Now this is squishy a little bit, but not even that squishy. Little sippy cup here. Just all dark pink. And then we have a super squishy lavender onesie here. That's gonna be our outfit of course. Let's see. 
we have a what looks like a brush that's really really squishy rubber doesn't even have any good kill on it but that's okay it's good for pretend here is a super squishy spoon to go with that bowl blue and yellow and then what else do we got in here I think we have little blue baby booties I don't know how those are going to go with that suit, but we'll find that out. And then, looks like we have some bath time stuff. Maybe some shampoo and some soap. Blue shampoo and peach soap. And we also have this cute little double pump. Oh, it's a bear! So I'm going to have to show up and focus. It doesn't have any... Um, Paint detail, but it's cute and it's rubbery and unpliable, so it should be cute on our little Camilla's face. Let's check out Camilla. So here she is. She's got a really big head, really accentuated head, which I really like. Um, her head's really super squishy, and because she's supposed to be a spitter, and it does go all around on the joint. Uh, she has hands that move back and forth, but they're really, really loose. And then I think, I think her feet are supposed to move, but I don't know. Um, anyhow, uh, she has yellow eyes that are slightly slanted and closed like she's really sleepy. Uh, pink rosy cheeks. And dark brown hair that's in two side little pixie ponies with green elastics. And she does have a diaper on. But there we go. There we go. I got her feet to move. This is a very interesting pod. Let's get rid of the plastic. And we're going to leave Carmilla there for a second. Put all of her sisters over here. And then put this up and put this up. We'll actually put, well, let's put her in the bathtub for now. And give her a sippy cup. Okay. The booties might be for, uh, for someone else. Okay. So it looks like this is the pod we get inside. I'm wanting, wondering if these are just how the pods would have come without the big set. Because it all has, it has all of its tags and stuff on it. Um, let's just cut them off and we'll take a look at them. Sorry, this is going to probably be longer than the rest of them because we're still investigating the situations. Here is, this shows you how to pop, pop out the baby, I guess, out of here. So I think we do get two babies. Unless we get twins. Um, here, okay, so we have a checklist on here too. And we have an accessory list. That is so cute. Alright, um, okay. So it looks like uh, there is a tear strip here. These are cute. They have little this this little tear strip material. If you guys can see it, it has pictures like cartoon pictures of all the babies. So our first ball is also wrapped inside. Here's our little pea inside of our pod. So our, our first pea pod, Just pop open I guess like this. <laughs> we have a we have some pink. Heart sunglasses that are very, very rubbery. And then we have a little, I think it's a yellow shark. And then, what's this? A birth certificate. So, I don't know if the sunglasses are a clue, but. So I guess we just pop this other pot out of this one. And that's also got a wrapper on it. This is a pee poppin' experience. We have more accessories and then another, another checklist. Is this the same checklist as the one that they just they just throw in their checklists everywhere. Unless there's something else in this checklist. Uh, a big giant copy of all the accessories. Okay. 
I hope all these checklists are not considered accessories. Oh, and there's booties in here. So we have, okay. So we have, I think this is the same. Is this the same one we have? Yep. So we have the same. Exact. No, not exactly. So this one's more peach. This one's more of a light pink. But they both have tan tops. We have a little baby pacifier here. That's red. We have a little clip here that we're going to be able to clip our pod somewhere. And then we have little tiny spring green booties. And it looks like maybe some diapers? Or shirts? <gasps> Do we have the twins? Do we get like the rare twin? That would be like crazy. Okay, I don't think that there's going to be two babies that fit in here. Unless they're smaller. Okay. Let's see. Nope. <laughs> oh boy, he's really squished. Oh, uh, we're going to have to do some hot water treatments on him. Uh, please squeeze, squeeze baby's head to form. Discard this information after. So they knew that, that this baby was going to end up with a squished head. So, but who do we have here? She has the same yellow squishy eyes. But I like her head. I like I, I like her hair. It's blonde. Let me see. We have so many checklists here. We can. What should we do? We just one. Do we use that one? Oh wait. What does this Let's actually have a? Her name is Lisa. Oh, she has a, actually has a backstory. Okay. Squished head Lisa. <laughs> we'll figure it out later. Um. Just a few months ago. Wait. Just a few months old. Lisa already has developed a sense of fashion. She loves to play dress up and show off her fun creative hairdos done by none other than mommy. That's cute that they have bio cards. But I didn't see a bio card for the one that we had visible. That sucks. Hmm. Push her head back to shape. Yeah, I might have to do hot water, probably. But it was a cute little bib. Um, and then I guess she takes the red pacifier, which she will when I get her back together. But anyway, there she is. There's <laughs> crochet and everything. Um, hmm. Okay. <laughs> and I guess this might actually start. I was. I might actually hang these up. Um, with my bananas because they're really cute. Put this on here. And I guess this baby gets sunglasses. If I can get her head to not squish. I don't think those are going to stay on her. Oh. So the accessories are kind of... Um, some of them are a little poopy. Is that supposed to be a diaper? Or a shirt. I think it's supposed to be a shirt. We're going to have to do some uh, head squishing. Oh, wait. I forgot to put this outfit on. The outfits are kind of like... They're almost like LOL type fashions where they break down and you kind of slip their arms in. This might actually help with her loose arm problem. Maybe. But I gotta get the baby's legs in these holes. In order for that to go over there. And that to go in there. But 
that's all we have for you guys today. If you like this video, uh, give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and <laughs> we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.